Excuse me, I like to call for makeup because I think the glare off of Kent's head is like highlighting this side of my face too much. Oh, there, that's perfect. It doesn't bother you, does it? We created a company so we never had to go to a meeting again. And we created a liquor company so we never have to pay for liquor again. Exactly. Kent's company was a client of the company that I worked for, and part of my thing that I did with my own company was I took people fly fishing every year. So Kent was invited on one of the very first trips that we did that, and I learned quickly that he and I were always the last ones up around the campfire with the bottle of booze. People ask us all the time, well, why do you make wheat vodka? It's because we're in the middle of the wheat world. One thing we've always prided ourselves in doing is being a farm-to-bottle manufacturer. Raw material to finish good all the way through. No shortcuts, we don't have to tell any stories, we do what we do. So I always think and, and tell people that I think our job is to take this great raw material and do everything we can to get out of its way. Oh my God, that was awesome. I started to kind of tear up a little bit, that, actually. That was awesome. Thank you. Instead of finding a neutral product, when you open a bottle of dry fly, you're going to discover a delicious nose, almost like a vanilla. And then when you taste it, uh, you'll taste butterscotch and caramel and a delicious richness that no other vodkas have, have been able to accomplish. I have been told that I have the best job in the world. Uh, numerous times, but uh, yeah, it's fun. It's a, it's a pride thing. It, anytime you see anyone order dry fly or drink it or enjoy it, uh, you kind of throw your shoulders back a little bit because you feel proud that you actually made it. No photographs. I told you, no photographs. I think there's going to be a point where uh, we can't keep the uniqueness uh, and the beauty of a small craft distillery but uh, we'll worry about that when we get to that. We've still got a long way to grow. We definitely want to keep the magic here, and uh, we have to keep it small enough to do that. Unless, of course, somebody wants to buy us for $50 million, and then, you know. Actually, we're on sale right now for $47,800,000. Yeah. Then you can take it as big as you want, and we'll just uh, stand back and help. If we get a really nice offer around $42 million, we might talk to them, but definitely not $38 million. Absolutely. Absolutely.